called us, whether you're a prime minister or a pastor, um, running a business, teaching in schools, working in the police force, doesn't matter. We're each called to trust and obey. And uh, that's the life of faithfulness he calls us to. And that's how we live our faith each and every day, regardless of what your job is, and to express it through how you do that. Ladies and gentlemen, you remember before I was talking, this story to reduce society violence in children in school. Now, him, Prime Minister, he uses this in my experience to bring me violence with the teacher and with the police. And now you hear a day he left government, he left them a message. He left them a message. Now him is thinking this language he uses they protect society. They not protect society. And then when he uses language, he's thinking this language to going to move. They will be easy. This is not going to end this violence here. This violence he left, they're not going to end. Him to protect society, not to have violence. He was a bring them violence. Not to protect them to be safe. Now, brothers and sisters, this violence he left with me always they charge me case. They don't want they don't want me to talking how they bring society violence. This rule is them to protect them. When the abuse is you, them to be to want to be safe. And other people not to get information how they abuse the society with the rules and how they force society them to funding they have they blame them. Is this is this is the rules them to protect them? We are not allowed talking about your problem. And when you're talking with them to, to stop to bring society violence, them they can stop, they continue. I'm very pleased that the last thing I say as PM is here. So I'm not going to rely on my own words. Habakkuk 3.17 Even if the fig tree does not blossom And there is no fruit on the vines If the yield of the olive oil fails And if the fields produce no food Even if the flock disappears from the fold and there are no cattle in the stalls. Yet I will triumph in the Lord. I will rejoice in the God of my salvation. Micah 7 15. You like this one? As in the day when you went out from the land of Egypt, I will show you miracles. And in Micah 7 7 to 8. But as for me, I will be on the watch for the Lord. 
I will wait for the God of my salvation. My God will hear me. Do not rejoice over me, enemy of mine. Though I fall, I will rise. Though I live in darkness, the Lord is a light for me. May God bless Australia. May God bless our community. And may God continue to show his favour on this wonderful church family. Prime Minister Scott Madison, I'm not your enemy. Don't do intimidate to me like you are enemy. Stop you, you are people you fix you, you left you fix me to force me them to stop it. Them to stop it, I'm not your enemy. Is a you, you lost communication conversation to know to know who is your friend? Is a man you as a your friend? Is a man you as a give your advisor to protect you? Is a man you as a your friend? Is a this before you was a talking with you? And you don't use bad language in society. To bring them violence. And this I was told you. Ni to bring violence is easy. Na to, co to collect this violence. To stop this violence not easy. Now this you left with me. To stop it to me is not easy. Is you you can stop this. Is you you can stop this. To make you a society safe. I'm not your enemy. I repeat again. Is you you been you missing your self communication. Conversation. They bring to challenge you. When you been you listen. As you call, you call on you are your enemy. You been you are not challenging yourself. You been you are stronger. Now you are people you talking, you left them a message, stop them. Always, always to charge me case, I never did the case. Okay, brother, the Prime Minister Scott Emerson, receive this message. Take action to stop violence you left with me. With those people you give them a message, again give them a message to stop this violence. 